I'm really so pleased to have uh, received this citation from the uh, uh, Equality Agency this year. For me, it's uh, the culmination of a lot of hard work that USQ has been putting in and what it tells us is that this is a employer of choice for women and that's something that uh, makes me very proud because I know that diversity adds incredible richness to the workplace and drives the outcomes that you're seeing uh, coming from USQ at the moment. So what we had to do was to uh, uh, look at all of our policies and processes and make sure that they uh, actually enabled um, diversity to flourish at the university, so things like promotions, selection, recruitment, those sorts of things. But also we looked at all our committee structures and made sure there were minimum numbers of uh, female representation uh, and male representation on them. And we also did a, a lot of work around pay uh, uh, gaps because we know that right across the world and including universities, many of the mid-level to senior level executive appointments, uh, there tends to be a gap between the salary that a male employee might get for one job and a female might get for the equivalent job. So we did a lot of work around that and adjusted salaries to make sure that we had minimised that gap. Still work to be done, of course, but uh, this is the sort of work that w we were very pleased to be able to present to the Equality Agency to demonstrate our commitment to gender equity in the workplace. One of the things that uh, I absolutely believe in, and there's lots of evidence that backs this up, is that if you have a workplace that is uh, diverse, that represents all of the stakeholders, that enables people to be their very best regardless of who they are or where they come from, means that the university can go on and achieve the great outcomes it's achieving. You really don't want to um, undervalue any part of your workforce because it's essentially a waste of that human capital that you have at your disposal. So we've been able to um, engage and support female staff to ensure that they have a workplace that allows them to be their best and to fulfil their potential and that has direct benefit to the university itself. Yes, it is a long um, time, uh, a long journey to go on. We've been working on this for some years now. It does take time to instill culture change and to make sure that everything is working as you, as you want, particularly when you're dealing with uh, staff. But we think it's worth it and we're really pleased with the outcomes. So to receive the citation uh, today is something that makes me very proud and I think all of USQ should be very proud. We are now known and recognised and acknowledged as a workplace of choice uh, for women and uh, that means that our entire workforce benefits. Th to achieve this award, it's uh, really quite prestigious because um, it's very hard to achieve the hurdles that they set. They're constantly setting the hurdles at best practice and each year it gets harder and harder to achieve a citation. So each year we're going to have to strive even further to ensure that our workforce is as equal and as accessible as we can possibly make it for all people who work with us. So it is quite uh, difficult to achieve uh, and um, there are only the very few uh, organisations across Australia that have received citations and I'm so proud that USQ is one of those uh, organisations.